This pandemic has swept the world in an unprecedented manner and forced us all inside for months on end. Only now, with restrictions easing, people are finally starting to experience some sense of normality again. But today, we'll be shining a light on the people whose greatest fear is the very idea of re-entering society. These are the people we like to call Manchester United fans. And with Liverpool being crowned the champions of England for the first time in 30 years, and now no longer able to hide behind the safety of lockdown, we speak to die-hard Man United fans who are preparing to come face to face with reality. I'm speaking with Arnold Wall, a lifelong Man United fan who established the sanctuary during lockdown, catered specifically for his fellow fans affected by the most recent Premier League campaign. As you can see, we have everything a fan needs. We have posters, we have books, we have the treble on repeat. And of course, we're following all the COVID-19 guidelines. So what exactly is it you do here? We do a lot. Most recently, we've been doing memory games, mind games even. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sit down, please sit down. We try to keep our thoughts only positive. Focus on the good times. And today's topic is Berbatov's hat trick. Oh. <laughs> and are there any restrictions for joining? Well, we've had thousands of requests, but we have to follow the government guidelines. So the ones here are the people who really need it. I see a lot of the younger generation. <laughs> well, they need it more than any of us. They'd never witnessed the good times. They need to know that they happened. And when did you conceive this? Well, during the lockdown, uh, when it became apparent that the unthinkable Liverpool would happen winning the again. League. What? Hello, Brendan! Brendan! He wasn't ready to hear that! COVID 19! We came good too late to catch them! Now, we could have done it if we got Fernandez in the summer, but, but we could have done it! We could have done it! We could have done it! What? What? What do we say when it gets too real? What do we say? 20 times. 20 times. 20 Everyone? Times. 20, 20 times. times. 20, 20 times. 20 times. 20 times. 20 times. 20 times. 20 times. You seem to get quite upset there. It can be hard for people to adjust. These people are safe here. They're not ready for the real world just yet. And what are you doing to prepare them? Well, first, we tried to put them directly face to face with the fan of the old enemy. How did that go? Not great. So what else have you tried? We brought in fans of other teams who have more or less been at the same level as United this season. Such as? Chelsea fans, Leicester fans and the like. No Arsenal? How about Manchester City fans? I couldn't find any. But of course, the, the final step of all of this is acceptance. Of the unacceptable. Yeah. 20 times, 20 times, 20 times. Each member will go through a sort of interview process, which is usually hosted by Arnold, where they will have to accept what has happened and then re-enter into society. I say usually because Arnold is allowing me to do the interview today and I will be interviewing Brendan, our friend from earlier. Wish me luck. Brendan, it's good to see you again. Okay. Do you know why you're here? No. Maybe. Uh, is it time to go back to the real world? <laughs> do you feel ready? I've had some good times here. Yeah. Remembering the great times. Rooney's overhead kick. Brendan. Oh, Beckham from the halfway line. Brendan. John Terry's slip. <laughs> it's time to look towards the future. Oh, the way Fergie did with the class of 92, huh? Brendan. You'll never win anything with kids. That's what Hansen said, but look what happened. Brendan. I know. Look, I, I know. You need to say it. Say what? 
You know what? Please don't make me say it. Look, I I'll start you off, okay? <laughs> Liverpool are... Liverpool are... L Liverpool are... The Premier League... The Premier League... Biggest load of f***ing cheating c**ks. Remember the Steven Gerrard slip? We all do. 20 times, 20 times, 20 f***ing times. Some people will never be able to accept it. It's just safer in the past. How long does it usually take? It's hard to say. Well, what about previous success stories? Well... You have had success stories. I see. To be honest, I don't think we'll be here much longer anyway. Why so? Well, with Martial, Greenwood and Rashford up front, I have a good feeling that next year be our year. Goodbye, Arnold. See you. See you, lads. Thanks very much. Take care. I wish I could say that I believed these people would leave this self-made sanctuary of former glories and would return to society with their heads held high. I really wish I could say that.